okay then it's been a long time coming this it's empty to be anyway yeah but i'm ready for me for doing my first um soldering on me boiler um and the first the first part of soldering job is to solder the tubes into the um tube plate and the tube plate into the inner firebox as shown on this diagram here and then after I've done that, I've got to get it re-inspected by the boiler inspector so he can check all these joints. Uh, oh, and I missed the stays off. There's three stays to solder in. So that's going to be the first little part. And then after that, the old boiler can then be put together and the old lot soldered together. Uh, I've got all my parts in front of me laid out. And... Uh, I've just made me send a little set of instructions on on to on everything that needs to be put together so just so I don't forget anything. Um I've cleaned all my joints up. Uh all the tool bends have all had a good clean and they're all side of side of me here. I've got the inner firebox inside all cleaned and, and the holes where the screws stroke rivets go. I've got the end, the, the tube plate all cleaned up and all the holes inside cleaned and everything spotless. Uh, that's all ready. And down here I've got the stays and the nuts and the rivets all, all degreased and clean and I'm just about to uh, mix a bit of flux up uh, I'm not mixing too much up at once so I'm, I don't want to waste it so uh, I've got a spoonful of flux in and uh, apparently you put a drop of just one drop of washing up liquid in just to help that flux flow and then that's all mixed with a bit of water so I'm now ready for assembling and fluxing as I go when I've, when I've mixed the flux up with a bit of water
Right, so I'm just going to progress now and flux everything up and get everything in position uh, ready for silver soldering. And it's just important that everything you do here is kept cl clean and everything's cleanliness is everything really. And make sure you put plenty of flux on everything. Right, so I've got all my tools fitted now. I've just got this last one to do and this is the end where I've turned uh, approximately seven or eight thou off the end so that it slots into the uh, tube plate and do not drop through. And uh, I'm just fluxing this last one up and putting this last one in and that's just re been repeated with all of them. Right, so that's gone down onto the shoulder now and they're all in now. So what I've got to do now, um, I've got my, my, my screw rivets in, um, I've got my stays in, all fluxed up. I've just got to put this, uh, thread this uh, top tube plate on. You can't quite see, I might have shot on top, but this is going to go on top just to keep all the tubes lined up and in position while I solder all the bottom. So that's just there for a guide. Or it will be when I've threaded it all on. Okay then, that was a little bit fiddly to do, uh, a bit awkward to do, but you've just got to be patient and thread them on individually and find them that's slightly longer than others and get them in first. Uh, sorry I zoomed in there and I caught my finger on button. Yeah, so I've got me, me top plate on now to keep everything in line. I've got all my bottom tubes in up to that shoulder like I explained. Plenty of flux on. Got me stays in. Got me my screws in, uh, my rivet screws or screw rivets, whatever you want to call them so now I'm going to get my uh, brazing hearth ready and then we can uh, start brazing them up
Okay, then I've, I've finished silver soldering now and I'm just uh, dipping it in some uh, dilute acid to clean flux off. I'm going to leave it in there for half an hour just to clean flux off. Okay, then that's first bit silver soldered. Uh, I'm happy with that. I can see a ring of solder round all tubes. And if you look on inside, I don't know if you can see up there. Uh, I'll just shine a light. I've got plenty of solder in that. Uh, in fact, I've got too much because it's running down sides. But better to, better to have too much than not enough, I suppose. And I've got a ring of solder around all them tubes. Uh, I've had it in acid bath and I've just dried it off and uh, I suppose now I'm ready ready for that stage to be rechecked by a boiler inspector. I've still got to uh, top tube plate keeping them all together sorry about jerking up camera it's my stand's tight uh, right so uh, I've just got to wait now for the next boiler inspection to get that checked